Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Pandora and we are on chapter 13, Panic, with Dear Mona. Let's get started. In the last episode, she found out she was pregnant. But she don't know whose this is between Mark or Sean. Let's get started. What am I going to do, Blair? I don't know. This is seriously crazy. Do you feel pregnant? I don't know. I've never been pregnant before. Whatever I would explain the nausea. Pandora, you're turning white. You need to st steady your breathing. We'll figure this out. What's your first step? I have to go to the doctor. But my primary just res retired. And getting an appointment there it would be if you do have one is impossible what office is it landmark it's down on the main street I I may know someone who works there really who Ralph's mother it's one of the things he was blabbing to me about one day call him ask if he can get me appointment stat Ugh. Blair, this is an emergency. You have to put your annoyance with Ralph aside. I'm desperate here. Okay, fine. But I don't have his number. We'll have to go by his house. He lives by the high school. Great. I'll get my keys. Now, be nice. I need that appointment. Okay, okay. You're lucky I love you. And this, and that this is an emergency. Stop wasting time. I'm getting more pregnant by the minute. Go up and knock. I'm going, I'm going. Blair, I can't believe you're here. I can't believe it either. To what do I owe the pleasure? This is my best friend, Pandora. Have you guys met? No. But any friend of Blair's is a friend of mine. Oh, God, is he serious. Stop it. Anyway, I was hoping you could do me a favor. Anything. Pandora here needs a doctor's appointment. I remember you telling me your mom works at Landmark. Can you sneak her in tomorrow? Hmm. I don't know. She's a very busy woman. Come on, Ralph. Please. It would mean the world to us. Okay, I'll help. Oh my god, thank you. Thank you. Can we go now? On one condition. What is it? We'll do anything. Well, Pandora, this concerns Blair. Can I speak to her in private? Um, sure. Pandora. What? I'm not sure this is a, such a good idea. Why? I don't know. This seems suspicious. What if he wants me to spin, send him naked pitch? Come on. You said it yourself. Ralph's a nice, boring guy. Oh, if you say so. Blair looks uncomfortable. She's been avoiding Ralph so much. Then again, he's not that bad. And I could totally eavesdrop. Then I know if he's asking her something stupid. Do I leave Blair alone? Leave Blair on her own because you need Ralph's help. I'll leave you to it. Blair is a big girl. She won't let Ralph push her around. Besides, she really doesn't seem like a bad guy. Blair, did you arrange it? I'm sorry, Pandora. Ugh, I'm so mad. He asked me to go out on a date with him. That was his condition. I just couldn't do it. That guy annoys me so much. I'm really sorry. 
Blair, it's okay. I'm sorry I pushed you into an uncomfortable situation. I can't believe he didn't want to help us. I thought he's a nice guy. Yeah, well, me too. Turns out even Ralph has a dark side. Then it's settled. I'll go to the hospital. We've been here waiting for hours. We should have gone to the, the private clinic to see Ralph's mom. I should have done what he asked for. I wasn't going to do I wasn't going to do that to you. I just hope I don't see anyone I know here. Hold that thought because here comes trouble. Well, isn't it Pandora? What are you doing here? Got a nasty itch or something? Nope. Just a pain in my butt and she's standing right in front of me. Good one, Pandora. Ha ha. You wouldn't be here unless something was really wrong with you. I'm sure Sean would be interested to hear about this. Go ahead and tell him whatever you want. See if I care. Please don't, please don't. I think I will. Have a good day, ladies. She is the worst. I should have confronted her when I had the chance. We need to get out of here. But you haven't seen the doctor yet. I don't care. I can't take the chance of running into anyone else I know. Later that night. So, you have an appointment with Ralph's mom tomorrow morning. What? I texted him to set up a deal and it was it was tolerable. One date for one appointment. You can thank me later. Oh my god. Thank you so much. I owe you one. Yeah, you do. Going to the hospital was a bad idea. Sean texted me asking if everything was okay. I had to lie to him. I feel terrible. I'm sorry. But at least we'll get the answers you need tomorrow. Sad face. What do I wear to the doctor's appointment? Hopefully I have something appropriate. Consuming the circumstances. I'd really like to leave a good impression. I don't have... No. I don't know how to get out of this. God. Why did I click? Whatever. I'm not buying anything. It's just making me do it. It just won't let me do it. <laughs> Maybe I can do this to get out of it. There it is. My camera was over it. We'll look through the outfits. It says this one. There we go. This feels right. I would definitely leave a good impression. And I hope the doctor will be sympathetic. The way things are, I could use all the friendly faces I can get. Please, 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 please don't let me be pregnant. Sorry, I'm 
I'm texting my brother. What the hell would I do? My mom would kill me. Why don't you sit down? Oh no. Isn't it's true then? I'm pregnant. Yes. The test confirmed that you are four weeks pregnant. Congratulations. Poor baby. Hey now. Don't cry. I know this sort of news can be overwhelming. Overwhelming isn't the word. This is a disaster. Take a deep breath. It's going to be okay. Doctor says everything will be okay. Do I agree with her? Yeah, it will be okay. You're right. I need to stop freaking out. It's not doing me any good. Exactly. You have options. You don't understand. I'm only a senior in high school. I don't even have a job. I can't take care of a baby. You must think I'm so irresponsible. I don't think anything. Now, is there anyone you want to call? A family member? The father? I don't know who the father is. Do I share that with her? Skirt the truth. I... Oh, God. No, there is no one I want to call. What am I going to do? You don't have to decide now. Why don't you go home? Discuss the information and you can and you can come back in a few days or so. How does that sound? Okay. I'm prescribing you some vitamins. I want you to take one a day. Okay. It's going to be all right, Pandora. I'm going to help you. I think I'm beyond help at this point. Marker Sean. I don't know who whose it could be. I use protection every time. Damn lying condom commercials. Hey Pandora. Max. What are you doing here? You should be at school. You should. So should you. I'm not going today. I needed some time to think. I can imagine. Blair told you, didn't she? She did. We are the three musketeers, after all. Don't be upset with her. I'm not. I would have told you myself, but... I have no idea what I'm going to do. I don't even know who the father is. Well, if you're up for it, I have a little vice and a confession of sorts. Do you want to hear it? You see, there might be a situation or for your certain situ a solution for your certain situation. Sure, there's something I haven't told you or Blair. I wanted to, but I was waiting for the right time, and now it's starting to feel like the right time. What is it? I was adopted. You were? But I didn't find out until middle school. It was really hard. But then I realized it didn't matter. Dan and Evelyn are my parents in every way that matters. Wow. The three of you are so close. We are. I I don't know what happened to my real parents, and neither do they. I have learned to live with it. So? Why are you telling me all this now? Isn't it obvious? I don't know what you're going to decide, but adoption is an option, and it's a good one. I have no idea what I want to do yet. I know. But if you ever want to hear more about it, my parents and I can help.
Thanks, Max. You're a great friend. So are you. Now, before I get to school, I have to know. Who are you going to tell? Are you going to tell them? Mark and Sean, you mean? Yes, I am. I'm going to be honest, no matter what I decide. I'm going to be honest. How are you going to break the news? I... I honestly have no idea. Uh, um. Old wives tell. Now that you know for sure, you have to break the news to your guys. That'd be chapter 14. And I will see y'all in the next episode. In chapter 14 to see... What else Mona has planned and how she's going to tell the guys that she's pregnant and she don't know who the father is. But anyways, I will see you lovelies tomorrow. I hope uh, y'all are enjoying the series because I am. And I will see y'all in the next video. If you are liking this, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Hit that bell icon on because I upload twice a day. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.